Well, one of the victims was a senior at Booker T. Washington High School. NBC 6's Maddie Weir is stopped by the school this afternoon to hear more about his impact on students and staff. Maddie? Yeah, Jackie, when students left the school around 4 this afternoon, you could feel how solemn the mood was. And at this time, the student's name has not been released. But like you said, we do know he is a senior at BTW. And I spoke with the school security guard who knew him well. Yes, he was, he was a good kid and uh, didn't have no issues out of him. Played football and everything. And, you know, it hit a lot of people kind of hard. And, you know, it's, it's senseless killing. We got to do something other than uh, just keep saying we're going to have prayer walls, prayer vigils. We got to step in and start talking to people and seeing where people hurt. Kimball told me there are quite a few people on campus who the students can talk to as they process this traumatic news. And as we just heard, the victim was on the Booker T. Washington football team. They face off against Woodlawn at Independence Stadium tomorrow night, and we're working to see if the team will be doing anything to remember him at that game. Back to you. All right, just heartbreaking. Thank you very much.